Hi there, Internet. My name's Court, and you've got courtside seats for my review of the first two episodes of Hawkeye. Let's do it. Hawkeye is an action-adventure crime miniseries from creator Jonathan Igla and Marvel Studios. The limited series stars Jeremy Renner, Haley Steinfeld, Tony Dalton, Linda Cardellini, and Vera Farmiga. Former Avenger Clint Barton has a seemingly simple mission, get back to his family for Christmas. Possible? Maybe with the help of Kate Bishop, a 22-year-old archer with dreams of becoming a superhero. The two are forced to work together when a presence from Barton's past threatens to derail far more than the festive spirit. So Hawkeye is a six-episode limited series featuring Clint Barton, and my friends at Disney sent me the first two episodes. Now I'll give this caveat straight up. I'm not like super psyched for Phase 4. So far the only thing that they've done in Phase 4 that I straight up haven't liked was What If? I didn't even finish it. While I mostly really liked WandaVision, Shang-Chi, and Loki, I was kind of mixed on Eternals, Black Widow, and Falcon Winter Soldier. I'll also say that I do like Hawkeye as a character. I do think it's kind of cool that he's the only Avenger with a family, but I've never really felt the need to see a Hawkeye standalone project. And it did help that, at least in these first two episodes, the focus is a little bit more on Steinfeld as Kate Bishop rather than on Barton. Perhaps that'll change as the series goes on. I'm only seeing Steinfeld in a couple things, including Bumblebee, but I actually really liked her in this. I imagine she's got some stunt people working alongside her, but still, it seems like she's really pretty good at the physical stuff, and her comic timing's really good. Renner and Linda Cardellini are also quite good. I mean, they've been playing these roles for a while. We've got Vera Farmiga in here. I'm not sure if I like her character yet or not, but it's a solid performance. And Tony Dalton's character is maybe not quite as over-the-top and cartoony as his character in the latest episode of Better Call Saul, but it's still over-the-top, and it's pretty fun. I'll also say that the chemistry between Barton and Bishop works really nicely. I want to quickly talk about the opening credit sequence. I got a very James Bond vibe from it. It's animated, it's pretty cool, goes on a little long, and I imagine going forward I'll probably click the little skip intro button. Now we've seen in the trailers that there's a Steve Rogers musical going on on Broadway, and we get to see a couple moments of it in this show, and it's pretty funny. It's like delightfully cheesy as Broadway musicals can be. I got a couple of pretty good laughs out of it. In fact, that may have been my favorite sequence in the first two episodes. Now there's not a huge amount of combat in these first two, but what there is is decent. Not amazing. Certainly nothing game changing. And for a guy who doesn't have superpowers, he's just really good at fighting and archery, I do hope they up the game in future episodes. Now there's a sequence in episode two where Barton infiltrates, let's just say a very niche society looking for a MacGuffin, and it's absolutely ridiculous in a good way. Again, I got a bunch of laughs out of it. It's so silly, but it's fun. I also have to say the CGI in this series so far is not that great. I mean, it works well enough, but there's some stuff involving fire, which maybe I'll find out later was totally done practically and I'm just an idiot. Distinct possibility. But it did not look very good to me. Overall, I dug these first two. I'm not like champing at the bit for more, but unlike What If, I'm hooked enough to watch a couple more episodes. I'll probably finish it. There's only four more. Now, I don't have a proprietary rating system as of yet, so I'm just trying to figure out what I'm going to give the first two episodes of Hawkeye. I think I'm going to give Hawkeye a... I know you like me. Out of 10. So now I want to know, are you looking forward to Hawkeye? Have you seen it yet? What did you think? Who's your favorite Avenger? Whatever your thoughts, hit the comments below. Let's discuss. If you enjoyed this review, please smash that like button and give it a share if you really enjoyed it. it. Just helps the video reach more people, helps the channel grow. I appreciate it very much. And hey, why not take a second, do me a favor, click subscribe and ring that bell to subscribe to my channel for more movie reviews, entertainment news, trailer reactions, all that good stuff. Hope you guys are all safe and healthy. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.